make no mistake, okay? These halls are haunted by a ghoul of some kind. This is a horror game. This is not a this is not a janitor game. This is a horror game where there will be a there will be creatures in these vents, in these halls. This is not this ain't a game for grandma, all right? I'm feeling weird today. After D&D sessions on Thursdays where we all just hang out for a while, and last time we did it on a Saturday and we had decided at that point that we do it on Thursdays. But um, the Saturday side effect was I got horribly hung over the next day and it didn't go away for two days straight. It was bad. Uh, and I was like, well, this time I'm not gonna let that happen. I'll just have like an edible instead and hang out and I'll, and that'll be out of my system. That's just an edible. So I'm now pretty confident that one of my COVID side effects is that my body just cannot process uh, things anymore. Cause like, I don't feel high at all, but what I do have is this like tickling in my throat, this like tickly feeling that I get when I get like, when I eat an edible in my throat and esophagus that will not fuck off. No, it's not munchies. It's not that. I just, I don't eat, I don't feel high. I feel completely fine other than just some shit in like, in just my windpipe. That's just like, you gotta fucking, you gotta like cough. I don't think it's like bad enough that I would stop having an edible every once in a while, to be honest, but it's like one of those things where it's like, damn, this is the first time it's ever not gone. Like usually it's just a thing that happens when I'm high, which is fine because I don't care when I'm high. Weed can also make you psychotic, so you might believe things happen. That's a little bit of an escalation. I was talking, I was talking about my throat feeling a little funny. Hi. I was talking about my throat feeling a little funny and then someone else came in and was like, and we can also make you imagine things aren't real and make you go crazy and insane. I'm just, I'm so tired of my post COVID body apparently not being able to process anything that goes into it. Wait, are you on the stuff right now? Chat, I, I don't know why I talk about things with you guys. <laughs> I just don't know why. I literally, uh. sorry, I shouldn't have yelled. You didn't deserve that, but. Oh my god. <laughs> Tomatoes being mean, run sad cat. Tomato psychotic edible eater gaming. I have one edible in three weeks, and I'm the psychotic edible eater. The loathsome weed eater who just, just chows down on weed. The weed cruncher, he loves it. He can't stop, he needs help. Is it normal for the stream to start and Tomato just says he had an edible and then just stay silent for 13 minutes? Fuck you, dude. <laughs> Go fuck yourself. All right, I'm not- You you guys are not gonna get in my- I love making my streamer feel like a psycho, dude. I love it. Gaslight year, all year, all year round, dude. Love gaslighting, fucking shaking. I have to do it, dude. I love owning my streamer. I love it. Why do I have to work today and you get to be high? I hate this narrative that's being made that I'm high right now. I am, I took an edible at 11 p.m. EST, tomatoes famous 24 hour edibles. I fucking hate this. I hate post COVID arc, dude. I, I really do hate post COVID arc. I miss pre COVID arc. Yeah, I also saw Dave scroll by, but I didn't read his, uh, I couldn't read his message because I was too busy ranting. Hey man, I got a call from Grand Grand. Please stop doing the weed at the dinner table. Mom is upset. Dad is crying. Ah, <laughs> uh, yes. A beautiful day. Let's go ahead and make sure I got... This shirt is so bright, it's a shirt. Oh, what? Hello? What the fuck is it? What do you fucking want? They're not gonna stop. Dude, they got fucking weird hands. They got hook hands. Do you see those fucking fingers? Fuck off! Fucking Christ. What do you want? What, do you, what is it? The basement is flooded. A pipe must have burst. Oh my god. So, uh, let's, all right, let's take a look over here. Let's make sure this place sucks. How dare you fucking say that? This is my livelihood. My livelihood is taking care of this place. You're gonna fucking take that back. You're gonna be catching a plunger to the fucking face. I'll tell you what. Yeah, there seems to be some kind of slime coming out of the ground. You're a fucking weirdo. All right, you wait outside. All right, let's just hang on. All right, I got it. That's looking like it, Nancy. What? Hello? 
Thought I heard another sound, but it must have been. Must have been nothing. Well, I'm not gonna stay here. All right, we're gonna lock this. Chat, that was just a that was just a, a a basement hog. We get those every once in a while. Got some cleaning in. All right, that window. No, that now that window right there. That's a now that's a spotless window. And you know why I'm so quick? Because I know what I'm fucking doing. Okay, because I've been doing this job for 40 years. Mr. Spot, go fuck yourself. I didn't miss any damn spots. We all know that's a bunch of bullshit. I fucking love this country wherever I am. Wherever the hell I am, I love this country. The fog? I love that. No, it's not fog. It's smog. <laughs> no, no, no. It's not fog. It's smog. Going outside is enough to kill most people. Mm hmm. Yep. Wow, that person's standing there like a ghost. Hey, you! The fuck you doing? No, <laughs> Jesus Christ! I'm gonna have to talk to that old lady. Uh, who lives in here? Hey, Riedel? Hey, Riedel. Riedel. A2, open the fucking door. Riedel opens the fucking door. I hate, I hate floor two of this fucking building. I fucking hate floor two of this goddamn building. I don't come up here. Hey. Hold up. Yo, lady, you got a ghoul in your house. You ate too? <laughs> I have to wash this window. Ain't that nicer? There, I'm telling you, don't go in that room. What? 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 Man, you know, this is just what it's like being a janitor that huffs his own cleaning instruments all the time. All the... I, dude, I can't, I'm constantly catching those fumes from the... From the from all the cleaning instruments, all the stuff I use to clean. Yeah, I'm just like, dude. This game threw a jump scare at me that was so unbelievable that I'm like now in a state of like kind of like confusion and shock. Still, even now. Oh, when I'm in here, my the box is so big you can actually hear my character hitting the walls. I can't turn around. Oh, fuck, that's some kind of fucking spider! We're fine. This game's got some unsettling shit going on. I know it's got randomized horror the same way that, like, uh, the Mortuary Assistance game has. So we're kind of getting just, like, whatever the fuck the game wants to throw at us. It's not, like, scripted. <sighs> me Ma could see me now. If me, if that old bag literally in this vase could see me now, she'd probably be, she, she'd probably be mildly impressed, maybe. Let's go to sleep. Go on. Go on, fade all the way to black. No, 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 no. Get back up. Get back up. Get up. Fucking knew it. What do you want? What? What? What do you want? What do you want? I can fucking tell you. Your pitter patters from across the fucking building. What do you want? A2? Get the fuck out of here. I hate you. The power is out in the whole building. You have to check the fuse box. You gotta be fucking kidding me. It literally broke into my house this time. Alright, what's the fu- All the fuses are missing. That's the fucking problem. I got, I got your problem right here. Someone took every single fuse out that makes the power work. Every single one. I might have to take- Hello? Someone locked me in the basement. Someone. Maybe it's a building wide prank. Maybe they're pranking me. Because God knows everyone's got every key to every room in this entire fucking building. Every door can be opened by even the most basic of tenants. So surely this door is already unlocked. Yeah, the power will be back on in a minute, ma'am. The yeah, tenants are starting to get anxious. They're missing, they're missing their shows. Let's just... Let's just get it plugged back in, get the power back on. Cool. Cool. Power's back. I'm gonna close the door. I'm gonna go to sleep. Fuck that, I'm getting back up. We all know A2's in this room. So why don't you just come out? Hiding behind a... Some kind of... Hmm... All right. He too is wandering out there. They might need help with their property. Oh, a beautiful day. You gotta be fucking kidding me, A2. Holy shit. Holy shit. 
A2. Do I have to pull the fucking blind? If I didn't close the window last night, she would have gotten in to ask me about her clogged toilet. I'm telling you, this lady's unhinged. Lock my door. I just don't trust things. Let's take a wild fucking guess. All right, chat. Do you guys think it's going to be A2? The fucking tenant at A2? You know what? Let's cut out the middleman. Hey! Put the fucking clothes on, you fucking drug addict. Yeah, we have some weirdos on the second floor. They scamp around naked when they get high off their gourd on like five milligrams of THC. They just get fucking absolutely whacked out of their mind, dude. It's ridiculous. Answer the fucking door, I know you're calling. Holy fucking shit. <laughs> Holy fucking shit, are they really making me do this? Could you please come up to flat D1? Oh, okay. Damn, I feel kind of like an asshole for expecting it to be A2 at that point then. Because D1's having a problem. Don't I look like a jerk? So what's the problem anyways? Here's the leak, as you can see. Are you like a small child or just a small person? Because you got like the... F okay, you're definitely like an, a small old grandma. Uh, well, let me see what I can do. Yup, that's got... Yup, that's, that's been festering inside those fucking walls for a while. We gotta get that taken care of. Could you go to D2 and see why it's leaking down from here? I mean, I can see why, but at this point, we can rest easy knowing that whoever's in D2 is dead, probably. And they've probably been dead for weeks. Goddamn drug addicts. Goddamn, goddamn drug addicts on their fucking... On their marijuana. You take what I see the I see these people. I see these people every day. I walk in I walk to the second floor. You know what I fucking see? I see them with their fucking Benadryl, taking their one Benadryl, and then they're they're just fucked. Alright, for the rest of the week. <laughs> the dozen. <laughs> one one all it takes is all it takes is one. Alright. They're, they're zooted off the drill. I've taken one rope tussin. They're fucked. Okay. All right, that's the best I can do is three more buckets. I walked in there, put three buckets down, looked at them one time, and then scampered out of the room. My job was done expertly. And if she bothers me, go home now. Okay, you got it. If, it, if that bothers her, well, she can... Fucking drug addicts, goddamn weed smokers. <laughs> ruining this fucking country, that's what it is. All right, ruining this goddamn country. Every time, running on the ceiling, scampering through windows, zonked on fucking Advil. I've had enough of it. All right. I, <laughs> I've seen enough. My uncle, he fucking, he took an ibuprofen one time and he blew up. Beautiful Sunday. And by Sunday, I mean Sunday. Hello? There's some kind of, I think there's a wild boar in my room. Hello? I just don't like that. I've had enough of these fucking addicts, these drug addicts, getting naked, getting high on their melatonin gummies, or whatever the fuck it is they like doing. A tailor's dummy is standing in the hallway. Find out whose owner it is. Ring the residence doorbells and ask them. Hi, did you leave the creepy fucking thing in my hallway? Oh, <laughs> uh, hi. Uh, it's me, the uh, house meister. Uh, I'm wondering if it was you that left the weird fucking thing in my hallway, the, the mannequin looking thing. Wigand! Wigand! You leave a weird fucking mannequin out front, I swear to god I will kick your ass. Don't you fucking dare to- Make no mistake, god is my witness, I will kick through this fucking door. Okay, I will I will kick right through this door Last thing you're gonna see through that fucking peephole is the heel of my shoe as I smash a fucking hole through this wall Come back here right now. I Bet he skateboards inside You know first there's skateboarding around having a is he not gonna come back no fucking way He's not coming back 
You know, it's actually a fucking common misconception that people on the outside can't see through the people, motherfucker. You just need to practice. I see you in there. You think there's like a door can stop me? Oh, thank goodness. You hear about the flooding? No. No, no. I'm here to ask about a weird fucking mannequin someone left and the... I'm still talking to you. <gasps> I just, that one actually made me angry in real life. That was like a, I just care, that, the ex, that, that experience, I just carried out of the game with me and got really actually mad in real life, like at the game. You should be grateful after all that flooding, you still have electricity, old lady. You come over to this fucking door right now. Let's go back to my flat. I've had enough of this for the day. I'm gonna eat some Kraft macaroni and shit. Never mind. I'm not gonna have any snacks. I'm not gonna eat anything fun. I'm gonna- I guess I'm gonna answer the phone. Cause I guess someone's- someone's got a clogged toilet. I don't get- I don't get any warm water anymore. Take care of it, says A2. Oh no, A fucking 2. Yeah, I know you don't get any wa any warm water anymore because I cut your line to the warm water. Alright, that's why you don't get warm water. All right, if you want the long and short of it, it's because I don't like you and I've started sabotaging your apartment from down here. I'm gonna have my flashlight on, shine it right in her face. If this... If this bitch doesn't answer this fucking door the next time I ring this fucking doorbell, this game's about to get really dark. Okay, people are gonna start dying. If she made me, if she marched me up here to get her warm water. Ah, oh, Mima. If only you knew the struggles I experienced. Oh, Mima, you old bag. Why couldn't you have tried harder in your life to provide a better life for me and my generation? Piece of shit. I hold nothing but resentment for you and your generation for giving me these opportunities rather than like fucking fought blasting through space on a rocket ship. You fucking gotta be fucking kidding me. <laughs> you gotta be fucking kidding me right now. You gotta be kidding me. No fucking way, dude! The door didn't close yet! Yeah? 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 Take it out of the trash right now, you can wait. It's weak old Indian food. Been festering underneath my sink for days. Get away from this shit. Still wanna talk to me? Get the fuck out of the way! <laughs> Did you fix the boiler? Check your sink! Check your sink. When I rang it four times, and then you ring mine 30 times to ask me if it's... Hope you trip and fall down the stairs. Ooh, I don't know about that. What is that, slime? One last chance to answer. All right, I warned you. Ooh! Nobody opens the door. Whoa! <sighs> you better be dead in there! I'm coming in! Oh! Holy shit, this guy fucking really was dead. What the fuck is all this? You're not getting your fucking security deposit back. Jesus fucking Christ. Can't reach it to turn it off! I don't have time to deal with that. Put these can- I thought I said no open fires in the building. What is that, beans? Call an ambulance. Fix the tr fucking- fix the drain leak. Fix the leak. I don't think I have to- I, I don't think this is gonna come as a shocker. But you're getting evicted. Alright, you're getting thrown out. Alright, pack your fucking things. Cause whatever you did to this fucking oven, we're not fuck. we cannot allow this shit in the fucking building. You, I, I don't think this is a shocker. What did I fucking tell you? They were fucking absolutely worked out of their mind on spices. What is this, oregano? You high on oregano, you freak? I'm going to sleep. I'm never gonna get to make my Kraft macaroni and cheese bowl that I wanted to enjoy. I'm never gonna get to enjoy my Kraft Mac. I'm gonna be so busy all day running back and forth. And I'm haunted.
and we're haunted, and there's someone doing the Blair Witch corner trick in the corner of my fucking lobby. Stop that! Lights are on, it's not as spooky. Stop it. Don't go down there. Why, why, what did you do? Did you fuck up the basement? Holy fuck. That is not just a, that is a, that is truly a flood. That, 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 that there's what Benadryl does. Okay. Then you crawl around, slithering through fucking piping. Climbing in the goddamn washing machines to spin around because it makes you feel like, and I quote, a spaceman. Go ahead, kill me then, motherfucker! Fucking kill me then! Get the fuck out of my way! They're actually dead. Most sane day in Ohio. I don't know what the hell's going on with Ohio. <laughs> I gotta follow this idiot out of the room. Jackass. I hate my life. What a fucked up day. But have the key. God fucking damn it, what a fucked up day. All this for minimum wage. That's yeah, not good. This time, for real, for real. Never mind. And that's how you fucking time it perfectly, baby. Go, go, go! A two's gonna call about a broken bulb any second now. Yeah. Thank you very much for playing my first game. If you're watching this on YouTube slash Switch and haven't played the game yourself, please consider buying it. The game has random events, so your playthrough will be slightly different than the one you just watched. That is true. I liked it. All right. I will catch you all later. Goodbye.